Welcome to Audio Tips. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show beginners and new users to the Pro Tools software how to destructive record. I'm going to explain to you a little bit about it and uh, I'm going to show you what it's used for. Personally, I don't use it that much, but I'll just go ahead and show you guys it. Uh, actually, it's not clear in this session. Let's open one. Audio Tips. So we're going to go into our uh, edit screen. When you want a destructive record, uh, it's very simple. You're going to go up to the record button. You're going to right click it. You're going to go down to destructive record. Now, what this does, what destructive recording does, is basically it deletes anything that you record over. So be very careful with it. To be honest with you guys, I don't use it much. But what it basically does is, let's say you guys have a track over here. One second, sorry. Let's record something. What this basically does when you record is it, uh, Pro Tools has a uh, input program that automatically saves a lot of stuff if you if you select it to. <clears throat> so what destructive recording does is it will, it will just delete it forever. So you guys got to be very careful what you're recording. I never use it again. I, so let's just say I record over this. The previous recording that I just did, let's say I like the take, I didn't save it, I just recorded right over it. It will be gone forever. That's basically what destructive recording is. Uh, again, I don't use it much, but you know, uh, people have their own preferences. So I hope you guys learned something new today and uh, taught you guys something that you guys never knew. Uh, have a great day.